This morning, House Speaker Kevin McCarthy is urging calm, saying people should not protest if former President Trump is indicted. I don't think people should protest this, no. Trump has claimed he will be arrested tomorrow in the Manhattan District Attorney's investigation into alleged hush money paid to adult film actress Stormy Daniels before the 2016 election. Prosecutors are looking into whether Trump falsified business records, typically a misdemeanor in New York. But legal experts say D.A. Alvin Bragg could bump the charge up to a felony if campaign finance laws were broken. Lawyer after lawyer after lawyer will tell you this is the weakest case out there. And doing it after a person for political purposes. Trump attended a wrestling match in Oklahoma over the weekend after calling on his supporters to protest what he claimed is his imminent arrest. Sources say today the grand jury will hear from an additional witness, Bob Costello. He's an attorney and longtime Trump ally who, at one point, represented Trump's former fixer, Michael Cohen. This additional witness may or may not be the last one, so it's really impossible to know what this means for the timing of any possible indictment. The White House, though, did say it is on alert for any potential violence. Bragg is not saying whether he'll charge Trump, but he emailed his staff this weekend saying, we do not tolerate attempts to intimidate our office. No one is above the law, not even the former president of the United States. This is likely a, some sort of misdemeanor on an issue seven years ago. Andrew Dimbert, ABC News, New York.